So a birthday is a gift, even without birthday gifts. The birthday itself is one of the greatest assets we have. And I'll explain why. You know, most of us would think a birthday, okay, it's a nice day. day I'm, to me, it's special. To people who love me, it's special. Once a year, everybody remembers that I'm around, hopefully. Send me gifts, birthday cards, different greetings, etc., etc. But there's a lot more to it than, than, than meets the eye. Because essentially, if you think about it, a birthday is really the moment that you emerged from your mother's womb into this world. Now, you could say, well, what's the big thing about that? That's just a circumstantial whatever thing that happens. Everybody at some point emerges. But that's not the case. That's not how Judaism, and especially the mystics, see it. Your journey on this earth begins on your birthday. So is that a small matter? That's like the beginning of everything. If you could understand that point of departure, maybe everything else would be put into context. The day you were born is the day when heaven and the cosmos determined that the world cannot exist without you. That's a very different way of looking at it as just as someone popped out on earth. The first time when you came to this world is when the world was given a gift called you. And it was very deliberate and very intentional. It's not an accident. So it isn't just a celebration of your parents who had a new child. And it's not just a celebration for family and for yourself. It's actually the whole universe celebrates 